see front yard looking pretty good as well. Hey, what is going on guys? Dylan here with Solo Cuts Landscaping and thank you for tuning in to another video here on the Solo Cuts Landscaping YouTube channel. I appreciate every single one of you guys that stop on by and share some time with me here on the channel. Now today's video, as you can see here behind me, the grass is looking green. The grass is coming in great. This is two weeks after. So this is just going to be a little update on how the lawn is doing, how it's turned out so far. So guys, stick around, stay tuned, enjoy this video. Let's get right into it. Alrighty, so we are here in the backyard. As you can see, the grass is looking pretty darn good. And we got some decent germination going in so far. Um, it's hard to see, like, actually in the lawn because we had decent grass. Not the greatest, but decent. Um, but where I did see germination, though, is where it's pretty darn exposed. Let's see here. There you can see we got some good... Some pretty good germination going now. Probably honestly what I should have done is put topsoil down and seed, but I just tried to aerate as much as possible. I tried to water the grass down uh, before I aerated, but because of you know the work schedule, um, some areas were still pretty hard. Try wasn't able to get that good of a plug. Um, but in a lot of areas, we did get pretty good plugs. So I'm sure below this, um, it's the grass is sitting pretty good. So here is another spot that we had just, uh, I had to fill this in we uprooted a tree in the beginning of spring so um, I just took some soil from a job that we removed some from and uh, we put seed down so we got some pretty good germination going for first round um, I got a cover we're gonna put on top of this to help uh, see if we can get some more of these bare spots to pull through but so far I'm pretty happy with it so I have pretty good confidence that we're gonna have some good germination um, that like next spring I think we're definitely going to see the result of this aeration and herbicide. seed. Um, so but, but what we're going to do is I got my dad's push mower. We're going to go ahead and mow this and we're going to see, um, see how it looks after that first cut. So guys let's get this cut. Alrighty guys, so there you have it. Take a look right there. Now, I did um, only cut a little bit off. Um, I was afraid to go too short because I don't want to damage anything. I don't want to cut too much off at once. Um, so it's still left a little long. I'll probably cut it again this weekend um, just to drop it down a little bit more. But because it was the first cut, I didn't want to take too much off. I really just wanted to get it cleaned up because the grass was starting to just lay over a little bit. But I feel like it's still at a good height because 
um, the grass is rebounded, like it's not folding back over. Because um, I always cut this tall. So um, it's trained, I guess, to be cut at a higher height. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty impressed with how it looks. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put down some fertilizer there this weekend, um, really start pushing some good growth. Um, some basically a little more nitrogen, try and get that root system down. Um, but but yeah, it's looking pretty good. I'll, uh, I'll take you to the front. And uh, this is what I was saying on some parts that were super like just hard and I couldn't really get too much of a plug. Is this area right here. Um, I just, I couldn't really get much of a plug. You can see I barely broke ground there. So we'll see how this goes. But we are wanting to do a patio back here. Um, I don't know if that's gonna be a winter project to where I might do my own patio just to get some practice and, you know, obviously add it to the resume. We're starting to dabble into with some hardscape stuff. So, um, but yeah, so that's kind of the plan here. This is our new fire pit. As you can see there, pretty good. I need to get some topsoil, fill in the void there. But yeah, this, if you haven't had a fire pit, I was wanting one. I wanted one to be different, unique. So that is what we went with. Oh, look. <coughs> Kid life, right? But yeah, so I'm pretty impressed with this. Uh, like I said, this is 14 days after. Still got some good germination coming through. We have some warm days coming up. We have some rain, so it's hopefully gonna look pretty good. Let's see, front yard looking pretty good as well. Looking good. Let's see if we can see some. You can see in there. You may not be able to pick it up on the camera, but you can see some some smaller blades. I have new seed. It's my dad. They're tearing out some some annuals. Alrighty guys, so that is it. That is a two week update of my lawn. There you can see, looking pretty good. Looking pretty thick. I'm happy with it so far. Again, if you wanna see what I did to this uh, a couple weeks ago, I'll tag that video down in the description below for you to check out. Um, hopefully I left a card in it. If I didn't, hey, take it easy on me a little bit. All right, weirdo. Yeah, whatever, guy. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for tuning this video. If you did enjoy it, do me a favor, give it a big thumbs up. Drop comments down below. Are you guys getting your lawn prepared this fall? So that way next spring, it's looking pretty solid. Um, I'll do another progress report. Um, I may even do a video of like the fertilizer we're gonna be putting down and uh, just show you a little bit of progress report. So, folks are just so nice waving today. So anyways, guys, thank you very much. Uh, if you're not already subscribed, guys, do me a favor, be sure to smash the subscribe button and hit that bell so that way you get a notification every time I drop a video. And guys, as always, remember, do what you love, love what you do, but never, no, never stop. Guys, we will see you in the next one.